So today we're gonna be making pork chutney. So what you need is one pound of ground beef. I have my ground beef here. We're gonna go get my scissors and cut this out. I'm gonna have this poke. Don't worry about it if you get um it's stuck or in the meat because it don't really matter. No, first thing, wash your hands, but I already did that. Just get it all up in there. Next, we're going to use a half cup of rice. And a half cup of rice. I have the one fourth cup because that's going to soft first. Garden half cup. I'm going to open this up. Okay. Whoa. Okay, it in. Next we're going to add half a cup of water or the recommended dose on here per cup. So this says two cups of water, but then we don't have all of this. And there's, y'all can do the math if y'all want to, or y'all can add a half cup of water like I'm going to. Okay, I'll be back with the water. Next, we're going to add Doritos Dynamite. Just pour them in. You only need two handfuls of lightly crushed Doritos Dynamite. And you can find this whole recipe on my All Recipes page or in the description below. Okay. Next, we're going to add one third cups of onion. Okay. Next, we're going to add one third chopped onions. I usually wing this part, but we ain't going to it. Let's go. Use it all. Okay, next we're gonna add our adobo. You can just wing this. They give measurements, but you can just wing this. If you get the red one, then you don't need black pepper, but I do because I got the red one. 
some pepper, and some garlic powder. Next we're gonna mix. Next time I'll get the right meat because do not get this meat right here, this ground beef. Get the get the expensive ground beef. I just had to because that's what my local supermarket had. And I didn't want to go to the one in the next neighboring town. So we're just gonna mix and mix and put that in the region. It's all on the sides and stuff. Okay, I think that's as much as we can do. Just make sure that every meatball has some rice in it. Okay. Next, what we're gonna do is we're gonna get a plate and we're gonna put meatballs on it. Think that's enough. Just a little too much. Let me just break that in half. Okay. I'll get back to you when I'm done making the meatballs. Next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna put turn this on half ten. So it goes up to seven, level five, then level five and four. And we're just gonna put a little bit of oil in it. About um, that much. I don't know if you can see it, so I can't. Just gonna spread it all around. And you don't have to wait for it to get hot, just add your meatballs. And now we're going to cook them until they're lightly brown, and I'll get back to you when they're, when they're lightly browned and looking delicious. Okay, so this is what they look like. Now, I stupidly found this recipe in all recipes, and it doesn't say to add an egg. So I'm like, oh, an egg is optional. Girl, add the egg, okay? Add the egg. Add one egg. Don't forget the egg. Okay? Now. So I'm going to send you the recipe, and it says egg, okay? So that's my recipe, okay? Now, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to add some prego, I mean some ragu. Well, you can add prego. This prego is a funny word, okay. I'm going to cut this down a little bit, and I'm going to add some prego. I can't add it all, because I have enough to make.
And now I'm gonna get you get a good look at it. Ooh, look at that. It's coming together nicely. It looks so delicious. Delicious. Okay, so we're gonna let that simmer for 45 minutes. Okay, I got it on two. So we're gonna let it simmer for 45 minutes with a top on it. And then they're done. So yeah. Okay, she gonna taste it. Okay. Taste it. How is it? <laughs> so, how did it taste? She gonna film me eating because there's no reaction. It tastes good, right? It tastes okay. It gives me like sloppy Joe vibes, but it tastes more like sloppy toppy vibe. Like instead, head? Of, instead of sloppy Joe, this is like sloppy toppy. Head? It tastes like the, you shove your dick in here in the process. I don't have a dick. It, it tastes like you fucked it for a couple minutes and then cooked it. And you left your residue in it. My pussy juice? That's kind of... <laughs> that's, that's what it is. Yeah. It looks hot. Hey, I'm always going to go get him for it. I'm going to go get him for it. Okay, cool. Let me get your reaction, girl. Oh, thank you. Okay. Are you reacting? Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'm going to do it next month, too, when I make the, when I mix <laughs> the other This thing. looks like something that would be in, like... Hey, how it tastes. Ulta. You don't want to watch it and make it dirty. How it tastes. That's actually the right. Yup, you already know. Okay, let me get her reaction. Ah! I won't, I won't show your face, but you're already on YouTube. I'm going to shout you out. You just send me the link and I'm going to shout you out. It tastes like Spanish tree, like the rice and stuff. Where you get this from? Like, where you get the... Walmart. Meat? And that's why you didn't answer me when I called you? Yeah, last night I was I was cooking. I was getting my makeup done so I could start cooking. Okay, start, start it. I'm scared, y'all, because I don't never eat, like... Let me see. <laughs> It's not bad. It's good. Mm -hmm. That is good. Yeah, try it. We need a fork. I don't. Need a fork, I don't like. It's onions. good. You put onions in there? Yeah, I put onions in. I put okay. one third. No, you have it. Oh, I don't know. You see all this fucking food on my plate? Shit. It's good, right? Huh? That's good.